Okay, Brendan with his fish on right away too. Now this guy knows what he's doing. He's walking it to the bank. So. Oh, okay. Well, hey, it's a good start and a good sign, huh? Yeah. Right on, right on. Yeah, righteous. Okay. Right on, Brandon. That's good. We're looking for bigger, and we'll get bigger sooner yeah, or later. We will. Should be okay. Cool. Okay, I like to think oh. Brendan will be back with a another, another one. one. Okay, that spot only go four feet over. Oh, oh sh baby bucket, fish on. Different lure. Oh. I think my fish. Oh. Baby bucket. Whoa, he's maybe an inch bigger than the shell cracker. <laughs> All right. Baby bucket. That's a decent fish. That's a decent one. Oh yeah. That's not wrong with that one. Sure wouldn't complain anyway. Damn country. There you go. Going below, huh? Yeah. So you threw on top nothing. Throw below. Get a bite. There you go. Baby bucket. Yeah, I like over there. Uh, in that okay. dark shade, yes. That's where the big one's probably going to be hanging. Okay, Brendan with the decent one. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Nice. Nice. Oh, that's a nice one, Brendan. Very nice. You're doing all right for yourself. It won't stop. Put him down, he'll be all dirty. Stay still, buddy. It's like I'm freezing. There we go. Another nice fish. Oh, he ain't too bad. He ain't too bad. That's a good looking one. That's bigger than the last one, Brandon. <laughs> okay, there's a release. And you caught it punching, huh, Brandon? Yeah, I caught it punching. So there you go. When they don't bite up top, go below. Did you slide your bobber stops on, tungsten weight, and your punch skirt. Then it's time for the hook. Now, you want to go through the front of the hook. The eye, right there. Give yourself a good little amount of line, then just make a small loop. Small loop like that. And all I'm going to do after that is just twist it. Around the eye. One, two, three, four, say five times. Now that I've done that, that loop, that remaining loop, just go right through it. Tighten down. There you go. Snell knot, solid. Yeah. Show them what they do, John. That they... Therefore, when you hook it like that, you're going to notice your hook is going to come bouncing straight up like that, going right in the side yeah. of that fish's mouth. That's a fantastic knot when it does that. So. Okay, he's put on a punch huh? bait, and that's good to go. Good little trick. Another one, huh, John, on Orange Crush? Yeah. Looks decent. Okay, another nice one. Yeah, four and, crush. four and a half pounder anyway. Not a bad bass at all. Let's get it back in. Might do some toolies. Okay, oh, already gone. There gone? Yeah. All right, to be caught again. Deep water. Okay, it was overall a pretty slow day, but we caught a few fish, so it wasn't that bad. But this is what helped me get them right there again. Can't deny it. Always gets me something. That's for sure. Okay. That pump is hot. Oh. Man, it's flowing big time though. This water movement's excellent. Where is 
You got them? Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of, there's small ones here and a few good ones in between. Baby bucket. There you go, there you got him, John. Fish on. Oh, oh yeah, spinning. cool. Oh man. <laughs> Okay, Brandon with a good fish. Oh yeah. All right. All right. Here we go. A little guy. Oh, okay. Well, that's a good one. Okay, there's Brandon's fish. Kind of on the way out fish too, so. Cool. Well, we had a good day with our friend Brandon. Uh, not the hottest bite, but hey, it was a hard fish, and uh, he made it happen. He yeah. caught a few fish, and it wasn't easy, so yeah. definitely was a good day then. Okay, it wasn't the hottest day, but we definitely got some fish, so it made it a good day. Awesome time with our friend Brandon, and uh, we'll have to do it again soon. Hell yeah. For bigger and better fish. Yep. Sounds good to me. Awesome day again on the Delta, hunting down those largemouth. We'll get him again. Right on, right on.